why quality control is more important than you think, and what guitars can you buy online. Interesting thoughts. Before we go any further, doing my being a good YouTuber today, I'm reminding you to hit like. Very, very, just push it right now. Then click subscribe if you haven't, and don't forget the bell so that you don't miss all these fantastic videos in the future. Comes with a free sandwich. It doesn't. <laughs> Darn it. Carry on. <laughs> okay. Back to QC. So QC is a thing. Like we all know it's a huge issue. Right now, in particular, it's more important than ever for one primary reason. There's lots of other subsidiary ones, but. So your guitar doesn't suck. <laughs> Uh, wait, no, that wasn't the reason. <laughs> I was thinking just the wheel of time when you said that. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah, um, that's good. Oh, I'll just depress you. <sighs> it's okay. Um, no, it's, it was almost good. No, it wasn't. Mm. <laughs> I got halfway through episode one and I stopped. Yeah. But um, no, it's um, there is such a buying frenzy still that guitar shops are getting guitars and they're selling them. We're selling them before we even have a, you know, like a chance to even like take pictures, write inventory descriptions on them, like be like, oh, I want that guitar. They hear it, it's coming or... They, they are, they're in a list. There's a list here. It's a magical list. So um, they're, they're, they're getting sold. There's major guitar shops, much bigger than ours, that are getting guitars in from some major manufacturers. I was going to say what it rhymes with, but that's just too <laughs> obvious. Um, that, that, they, they get them in, and like there's huge QC issues. And like, you know, like checking where they shouldn't be checking, nuts that aren't right, it's like right. bridges are cut a little bit funny, like where electronics. Yeah, just little things a little bit wonky. And like they're still selling them hand over fist. Like and customers, and this shop is a great shop. They will let these customers know there's some issues here, but the customer's like, I want it. I want yeah. my thing. That has two little devil horns on it. Um, <laughs> I, you know, I had to do it. You know, <laughs> but, well that's the, that's what sort of inspired we were talking. We read that article, you know, um, I mean, it's where like, you know, JC's talking, it's Gibson, we're talking about, where um, we're just dancing around for fun, but he's talking about, you know, like how QC is very important to them, and we know, we trust that it is, but they still haven't caught that curve. Right. You know, and, like, and, it's, and we hear it from everybody, like, and we love Gibsons, we always say it, we love Gibson guitars, we love to play them, we think they're awesome, I own way too many, you don't own enough. That's true. You own one, right? I feel like that's true for yeah, you should all, all the guitar brands. <laughs> Like me don't my, quite have enough. My two rock fetish. Like now I need uh -huh. a TS one. I didn't know I needed one of those. Damn it. Yeah. Um, no. no, but it's um. So they, they they've had struggles ever since you know the the demise of the old guard and then the new guards come in. They're trying to get on top of it, but it's not there and it's not there with a lot of other places either. Right. Now some places are really good about it. Yes. You know, like PRS has always been pretty notoriously good about it, but they've had some issues the past year as well i think everyone has you know between just, just a lot been more a than lot to, to overcome like lots of like years. issues with pots yeah. and like things like that and um some of that is supply chain right it's exactly. like getting quality like, you know pieces like, so. and, that, and that's that's even happened with some of our boutique like our amplifiers from magnetone to two rock there'll be like one component that they don't build that like fails and and so it's a it sours the whole thing it's a bummer so like everybody that's buying those amps understands you're getting like a handmade awesome piece. And they're so good. Like Magnuson in particular is so Two good. Is too. Two Rock is amazing about uh, it. We yeah, had like I mean, a all reverb tank yeah. issue and like he just sent us out reverb tanks to the, our people and to us like just have some extra ones. He's like, here. No questions. No like, oh, send us the amps or blah, blah. No, no, here you go. Here's your, here's your stuff. Okay. Got, yeah. Like we know how to fix it. Stand them. behind it. Yeah. Right. It's not, it's not like this whole like we have to send in like a form pictures and proof it's like oh my bad i got you that's kind of the joy of some of those like smaller companies is like we're literally talking to the person in charge over email and they're taking care of it so right if not the actual owner and of, <laughs> slash builder. or the designer of the <laughs> right. amplifiers anyway right. but so kudos to those guys for having some yes. of the best you know customer service i've seen in this industry because it's not always that way now it's um now getting on to like other guitar brands, like you know, I think you, you're still f extremely comfortable with Fender. Yeah. Like you can buy buy a Fender online, click on it. Now we're also talking about like, but and, and Taylors and Martins, hundred percent everything. But what shops can you buy from online? I think I think it, there's a weird there's this weird thing that you think is happening. Like I want to get it for a shop that I know there's going to be real boots on the ground type right. hands playing that guitar to check it and really run it through its course not a generic checklist that I've read through all these checklists and from different places, 
some of the things are really funny. It's like, you know. Strings. Has strings. Has Shit. strings. That's my favorite one. <laughs> that was the one that got, got me too. I remember Guitar st- has strings. All six. Hell yeah. You go through a 368 point. Like, I mean, I appreciate that. But then your guitar is going to go sit in a box again, maybe. Because like, it's not all bells and whistles and beautiful roses like this pitch. And I'm not talking about any particular guitar seller necessarily but like some of some of the big ones yeah. just don't have the ability to go through every guitar and the way like they're processing so many sales they miss things a lot more and don't get me wrong so do we and sure it, well like, we're not saying it's nefarious at all it's just it's just a lot you know it's a lot to do and it's sometimes I, any checklist like that i think you probably get uh where it is just autopilot you know what i mean well, that, I, but, good, well good, like good, some of these know. major guitar shops that i have like i have like they bring in like they got luthiers they're bringing or like guitar techs that have never teched before and they get they get do a quick little training class. I'm like, yikes, that's a little scary to me, but cool, I guess that's how it works. I guess that's like any job. I yeah, just look at job training, I'm yeah. still sort of old fashioned with guitars and then like I want my cats to have been around this for a long time. Yes. And like and had their again boots on the ground and been working with it and have actually, you know, every guitar that goes through here, like one of us is gonna go through it. It's something oh, yeah. like, we want I will not see every guitar. You will not see every guitar. Um no. but well, if it's a really cool guitar, we're definitely. Gonna I was gonna say. To. <laughs> it's hey, yeah, super well, cool. Well, let's see it. We're all gonna but, uh, have like a moment and talk about it. Hey, yeah, we're gonna open, you know, the, whatever. But we, have, uh, right? We have tons of guitars go through it. Like, uh, there's there's qualified members of our staff that goes through every piece, and like, and they, again, like sometimes something does miss, or sometimes something happens in shipping, or a component can fail, and we're gonna make sure that gets sorted, either through yeah. us or the manufacturer immediately. And if you don't want the thing when you get it, send it back to us. That's right. But um. I think that's an important distinction. Yes. That it's not going to be sitting like if you buy from Amazon, don't do it. Most likely, we did a thing on strings like, you know, I think last week. Sometime. I can't remember. Sometime in that, the past. That's, that's recent though. That's normally yeah. Yeah, in the past, like, you know, you send in these products and these things and they all get bunched together. These guitars can be sitting there for months to years without ever being checked on. You're going to get the guitar, so I may be wrong with it. It's going to be an issue. And there, it's. Just like the beef you eat. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Sorry. I had to. You said you'd be sitting there for years. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't uh, stop myself. Uh, what's, what is um, si- I'm sorry. Sidebar here. What's that? Um, I, I watched it on TikTok and the other things. like That, that steakhouse that like, has like the $1,000 Wagyu beef or whatever. They come out. They bring, they bring it in a briefcase. Have you seen that? They don't let me in those kind of places. But you've seen that? Like, I, things like the guys on TikTok that do it? No, because I've, never, so I've still never been on TikTok. Absurd. Well, they're on like other internet devices. That have been funneled from TikTok. My All apologies. right, I'll look. I'll no, look. But, but it's like it's this like thousand dollar steak, and like they, they come out and bring in briefcase. They have gloves on. They do this like sort of thing, and they look at it and make you feel all special. Like, then they put some sp- spice on. Then he cuts it, and he like he throws the salt like over his shoulder, like onto the steak, and he's like, bam, and you have it's like you he pauses, and you're like thousand dollars in, cool, like, yeah, I'm a big man. Like I would I would want all those things for a thousand dollar steak. I mean, it's so ridiculous and stupid. Yeah, it would be fun to do. Like, you know, just, yes. the, and you can film the whole thing. Like, they come out and they're like, doing, it's like the Applebee's, like, song, happy, happy birthday, happy, happy. Do like, you get sombreros, dollars. though? And it's not, it's not Latino or Mexican. It's, come on, dude. God. It's like, I've, I mean, It's a melting pot. <laughs> it's steak. But I, I don't know, it's just. <laughs> they can have steak in Latino countries? Come on. Oh, man. anyway. Anyway, sorry, side, side. I, I, I excited. <laughs> It's um too much, too it's much. It's so though. expensive. It's just crazy. We did have how much was that steak we had at the Taylor Guitars? I don't know, but it was really good. That was really good. It was a tomahawk. Tomahawk. Good that, Lord. What was the name of that restaurant in Nashville? The Cane Prime or something. God like that, Lord, yeah. like we don't eat. It. We eat it like McDonald's. McDonald's, and I Captain think that's D's. great meat. Um, it's I was, like, it's like the day I don't know where we were going. That we stopped at Captain D's <laughs> and dude, sent the pictures to my wife. I love Captain D's. <laughs> No and she was legitimately jealous this is the, she loves God, that's where you know you married well i know i know yeah it's um now this is the part where the guys watch some of the people watching the video are like i can't stand it when baxter gets off topic Ugh. so angry this it was my fault but if you're fair. a cheerleader yes. that doesn't mind that just give it give it a thumbs up like hey i don't mind because that was the happy <laughs> moment for me i'm thinking about long john so i think we're gonna have jersey mics today maybe are we? We're gonna go. We're gonna live big. We're gonna like big. live large. That's, big Kahuna. Nice. That's expensive in my mind. Yeah, it is. It's like a fifteen dollars. Yeah, sub. absolutely. Is. We, we share between like thirteen people. Or it's like when you go to Papa John's, to Little Caesars. Like oh yeah, large, dude. high like, on the hog. Anyway, 
So what are we even talking about? Back to the guitars. I'm sorry. QC, QC. I know QC and why we Obviously, buy it's from. low on our video. <laughs> We're just having so much. It's been a long, I haven't seen Johnny in a couple of days. It's, it's been, been like two days. Yeah. It's a long time apart. You know, yes. get lost in your best car plated eyes. Yeah. Um, how about wanting to do a Mandalorian rant? I'm not going to do it. Back to topic. I'm sorry. I'm back. That was like a two minute rant. I apologize. Um, but it was fun. It was worth it. It was. So you have to do like when you're dating someone and you're trying to, I was going to say get in their pants. Either gender it matters. You have to go through these awkward conversations sometimes. How about Beskar? Does that mean I'm trying to get in your pants? Unless they're Beskar pants. They are. <laughs> anyway. Um, so, so yeah, but anyway, the QC has suffered across the board for every manufacturer. Every manufacturer's had like issues because their, their demand is so high and it's punching. So it's our job as your gatekeepers is to check it. To make sure it doesn't get to you, and if it does, we can help you get it back easier. Well, so like in some, and just just put that all in a neat little ball. Go with me, universe. It, I feel like it used to be that you'd buy certain brands, um, mm -hmm. offline. No, no, quite like like Fender maybe. Yes, but like a Gibson, you'd want to go put your hands on it because you know. I still think that's the issue. I still think that's true too. But we're almost saying there's this new level of now. It's not just would you buy it online. It's where you buy it online from. Yes. And there's certain great online retailers that I 100% have faith. Like Wildwood Guitars, yep. Music Villa. Yep. Wildwood Guitars, Music Villa, 100% all the time as far as like their stuff. I also think you know you got Carlos at Chuck Levin's, who I yep. have complete faith in too. If he's not a freaking dance competition again, it's then, then it's just a slight delay. If he is. No, but like it, it, seriously, call Steve at um at Wildwood. They will take that guitar out. They they check every guitar first, but. He, and, but he'll, they'll go through the guitar and play it for you, as we would, as Music Villa has the best Gibson acoustics. You know, they have like, they, because they're right next to the freaking factory. They can hand cherry pick it. They go, oh, I want that one, bing. So if you want to get a Gibson acoustic right now, go to Music Villa. It doesn't make sense to go anywhere else. It's like, it's. I think people have called us before where I'm yes. on the phone with them and I just walk back to the acoustic room and the guitar they're interested in, I set the phone down and then I play it for like, I don't know, a, a few minutes, and it, yeah, sometimes a few minutes, and then well, I pick the phone back up and I'm like, oh, here, here's what I think. It's that's a lot of clarity. It's a lot of, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on, be right Quick. back. No woman, no cry. Never. We would never do such a no, thing. Um, <laughs> we really don't. We're not, we're not cool. But no, um, <laughs> it's completely lame. We're talking about Vescar armor. It's like, God, Lord, help us. That's true. Like Ron Thorne's got me on speed dial. We're like, yep. It's out of dice. Boom. I went down this rabbit hole. Of like this the spy spoiler alert if you haven't watched the book of Boba Fett where they're smuggling the spice yeah and then I was like oh and then there's spice in Dune and I was like I know, what I if I was thinking that too I, here, check, me, check this out what if Star Wars was before Dune and then the but Larry and Jihad happened they got rid of all the machines and they figured out the spice drug let them do the Mentot powers and then it turned into Dune. Because Dune is based off of our cultures in the future, right? Well, it's like, like you know, they can't have mankind. any machines in the likeness of man. No AI. So yeah, at some point, the machines took over. You would only know like that if you read all the stuff. Could even you look that. I mean, I just thought the spice just got my wheels. My well, little what were we talking about turning. before that just got side railed entirely? Um, uh, drugs, doing drugs. We okay, no, before that. Oh, you were playing that. <laughs> no, yeah. When somebody calls, though, yeah. like, like that's literally what we do. Is like, all right, cool. Yeah. You want to hear that custom shop? You want to hear that squire? You know, like, I'll go play the Squires because, like, classic vibes are pretty tight. We have a whole storage room filled with the Squires in boxes that we haven't taken out. But guess what? They're not on the website. There's a lot of them, too, because we're not going to sell them until we've gone through them. Like, they, we can't, we're not going to post them up. we got to play everything because sometimes stuff doesn't work. That is true, you know. You know, and then sometimes, um, yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a, you know, but we have, we have lots of guitars that are in boxes that have not gone out. They do not go up. For sale until we've gone until through we them, them and played them. Yeah, it's true. and then um, and then once they do sell, we play them again, and then they go on their way to find their lovely homes. Sometimes just because you know, there, you but there are. I would be wary of. I would never buy on Amazon a guitar or strings, um, and then because you're getting fake ones, maybe yeah, ten percent chance, maybe twenty. That's, yeah. a, that's a reasonable chance though. Like, <laughs> higher chance of getting fake strings than winning at blackjack in Vegas <laughs> for like rubes like us. But um, it just it just seems odd to buy your strings on Amazon. I mean, I guess people well, do it's it. Cheap, you can find it. You, yeah, you can find so. cheap. It's easy. It's so still I get like it. in my brain, you buy guitar things from guitar shops. But some people are like new to this whole thing and they don't get it. I, I get that too. I, I get. I I do. And yes, just, I just understand be, that. Just be wary of the the types of guitars. Like if you're buying a Gibson, like buy it from a reputable place that you know is going to check their guitars. Don't just get like 
top Wal- Walmart.com. You know, just kidding. I have seen some, but they're really there. Nice they are there. Are. It's and there's a whole little string section in Walmart now. It's a whole nother in area. Walmart. Yeah. Really? Where? Yeah, they got Dia Dario and everything. Where? It's like where the you know the albums and the CDs and stuff are. Oh no, kidding! And there's a little I'm section. I'm gonna go to Walmart later today. With like kind of toyish, you know, like first act kind of instruments, and then like Maybe strings I'm going to and Walmart. capos. I'm just saying. Okay, cool. Taking the kids to Walmart today. <sighs> My wife's out of town. It's like we're just like. What are we gonna ours. do? Bam. I, I mean, we talked about going to a fancy steakhouse. This, that's not. Don't do that. That's. I waste. might go to Brick's Pizza tonight though, because that's sort of fancy. It is fancy. It's not, and the owners, we have a great good. Brick's Pizza in town. We love the owners. And we do. It's true. Um, we call the, she, one lady who's one of the owners is called Kissy Monster to my children. because true. And she tricked them to eat salads when yeah, they were like yeah, two. They've been yeah. eating salads since then. I had a Christmas party there one time. Oh, yeah. That, that's when you got it. And then I got, I got COVID that very <laughs> night. It was fantastic. <laughs> then we all for, had to... for Christmas all the way through New Year's. It was great. <laughs> so none of us saw any of our families because of Johnny. <laughs> I, because of Johnny is very harsh. No, no, but. no. But none of us saw any of our families because of Johnny. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. No, yeah. Like, well, that's true. No, it worked out really well. It was a well. very peaceful Christmas. No, it was great, man. Because <laughs> I, like, I, like, I was like, I guess we got a quarantine. 2020 Christmas. Can't yeah, come over. Nice. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, it was awesome. Sorry, Papa. That was great. It's been through the whole shop. It's, well, it's, been, a, it's been a ringer. It's been fun. It's, I mean, it's been through. We've made it. It's been through this whole country, unfortunately. Stronger Two-town together. champion right here. <laughs> Sorry. It's I'm just, just a wonder. <laughs> I'm hoping to make that second round. It's like my dad has like seven hole ones or something or eight. Like, I'm like I'll have to dance if I get a birdie. Anyway, that's it. I'm ending. Take us home. QC, Barber Shops, you know. We'll see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>